And welcome back to Dank Mountain. We are currently digging our way downwards, as you do. I mean, it's Dwarf Fortress after all. And hopefully our plots have finally been completed. So let's do Cave Wheat, Dimple Cups, Pigtails, Plump Helmets, Quarry Bushes, and of course, for most important, the Sweet Pods. And we'll get right to planting, which is always good to see. Hmm. Now, regarding this thing, this object that is the cause of all my turmoil. Ah yes, what to do about you. I did want to encircle it. Be that as it may, perhaps a bad idea. I feel it is a good thing to at least attempt. If only for the sake of symmetry. It also most likely will lead to disaster, but I mean that's the risk we take for looking aesthetically pleasing. And I mean, to anyone that disagrees, this is most likely worth the risk. Now, we can't actually do it on this floor, unless we decide to build a second entrance to the fortress, which I wouldn't be entirely against. Because if we were to dig this upwards, this would enter here, and this would enter as such. If they come out as such, here, and we build a wall to cut it off. It might be worth a shot. Otherwise, we can always just wall off the entire area. Here we go, finally. Let's get some strawberries going, some rice plants, some uh, barley. I always forget. BP, not just a plain P. More than likely, our man is hard at work. He is indeed. Both of them in this case, actually. Of course, Permanent Admiratus actually... Uh, which seeds do we have the most of? We have two barley seeds. We have two of these seeds. One strawberry seed. And five rice seeds. Alright, rice is definitely the better choice. But strawberries will have to leave for now. And then we'll probably put barley on the last one. one it, once it comes around, of course. Which at the moment might take a while longer than expected. We have found ourselves a few, well, valuables, I say. Valuables indeed. Thank you. 
Of course I did that. It would too much it would be too much to unlike me not to. The four pillars of eternity. Also mountain against, you know, volcano and stuff, but hush hush. We don't speak of these things. At least not aloud. Also, no, we're not going to cut into the mountainside on this corner because, you know, we don't have a death wish. As to the rest of things, though, well, I think we wouldn't mind a bit of expansion in this direction. If only to open more farming areas and the like. What to put in between, I wonder. How will I join these areas that are so different? Make it the temple. We'll see what we can do. I prefer not to be surprised, so I'm gonna prepare a wall beforehand. Now basalt might just be the best choice at this point. And then we'll continue on the other side as soon as we finish that. Ah, some more jewels. Always good to see. And my diligent workers are already working on improving things as I see fit. Good to see. Mason's workshop can, to be honest, not do anything quite now, and a carpenter. Well, buckets and barrels are always going to be a problem. So we might as well work on those now. From here or higher, I wonder. Make it at the border of basalt. Gives it a bit of character, if you know what I mean. Oh well. Oh well indeed. I guess I suppose this one's more of a down stair than hey. This one, however, is definitely an up down. 
and this one here a down. Now where in God's name did my miner go? Has he forgotten his duties? No, he hasn't. I'm, I'm sure of that much, but... Still... Also, I need jugs, don't I? Oh yes, I need jugs. <laughs> Quite a few of them. Now, can I even make wooden jugs, I wonder? Most likely not. That would be too good. I actually can. Alright, well, I suppose that's what we're gonna do for a while. No need not to. Now, my dearest miner, what was your name? John Carlos. He's constructing a building. What building would that be? Ah, the wall, of course. The wall. What else would he be building? What a diligent, diligent man. Now, he is digging out our entranceway towards the volcano. Always good to see. He's definitely enjoying his work, I can tell that much. Perhaps these can be the sweets, right next to the volcanic lava. Put your hand to the wall and feel the power of the earth boiling beneath it. Or within it, I suppose, since you're not actually holding your hand to the floor. But let's not be technical here. No one likes a buzzkill. Well, the buzzards do, but even they have reservations, considering they get killed as it happens. Alright. Drinks are at 80, seeds are at 20, food stores are at 100. Seeds are still the same, of course, because, well, we did stop brewing for a bit. Alright, we're planting the seeds outdoors. Good to see, good to see. Definitely happy for it. What was this? This was rice, this was barley. Barley, barley, barley. Do I have to make this a gathering zone, I wonder? I think I might have to. Of course, in that case, I think I'll make the area a slight bit larger. All things considered, of course. Say the entire mountaintop. sure no one will mind too much. Oh well. At least for now it seems more necessary than anything else. After all, who would want to lose all that free food? And the harvest has already begun. Well, well, well. Jugs are beginning to be made. Add new tasks. Brew. Now, what was the button for? Ah, it does not matter. Hmm. 
three idlers still. We really cannot afford idlers at the moment. The carpenter, the stone worker, and the fish cleaner. What did I make the fish cleaner again? I remember it was an important job, but then again, I'm not quite the most important person. Fish cleaning, that's right. I made him a butcher, tanner, lever worker, and a hunter. However, hunting doesn't seem like to be his specialty. Perhaps I can encourage him to mine. I mean, what else can I make him do that is not already being done? Well, he is mining, so that is a good start. And we're finally hitting stone again. What good things to see. It will definitely clear up some problems with him. Build sea walls. Basalt, of course. workshop down here, just near the stone in general. It allows us to do some very fun things to say the least. And now that we have jugs we should be able to start collecting honey. At least slowly. Rat remains. How quaint. How very very quaint. Well, and harvesting will begin shortly. At least one will hope. The walls are being built. But mining is not being done, which is concerning. Start building some more up downstairs. After all, the movement of our dwarves is at our highest priority. And it shall always will be. I wish you could prioritize certain jobs. It would make life so much easier. Why is this something else? Rough basalt block pillar. You say that, but... Interesting. Very interesting indeed. There we go, now it looks back to normal. Yeah, I expected something similar to that, but that is the timer. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed watching the Dank Mountain one more time. Some migrants have arrived, and those will be named the next episode. I'll see you all then, and I'll see you all then again. Perhaps next time. <laughs>